All right, give this one a shot. Uh, in the GRE format, uh, we want to know is quantity A bigger than quantity B, or is quantity B bigger than quantity A, or are they equal, or is it impossible to determine based on the data given? Give this a shot on your own by hitting the pause button and then we'll do it together. I hope you tried it on your own. Now let's try it together. Okay. <laughs> I love drawing these out. It's actually fun to draw it out. Okay. So then that's 90 degrees. That's 90 degrees. So what we want to know, this is point A. This is point B. This is point C, point D, and point E. And what they're asking us is what is bigger? Quantity A is triangle ABC. And quantity B is the trapezoid B, C, D, E. If you look at it down here, this is quantity A, it's this triangle up here, and then quantity B is this whole trapezoid here. So the question is, what is bigger? Uh, now, let's first calculate uh, what they gave us, which was, sorry, AC equals 2CE. All right, so AC is double CE. So if we call CE X, then AC would be 2x. Uh, at that point, we can kind of calculate that triangle. If we call uh, this down here y, uh, we could figure out the area of the triangle. The area of the triangle is 1 half base times height. So it would be 1 half of y times 2x, which uh, the 2's cancel out. So the area of the triangle would be y times x. This is y and it's 2x. So the area of the triangle is y times x. Now let's figure out the area of this trapezoid. If we look at that trapezoid down there, if you think of it this way, that trapezoid is gonna be whatever the rectangle is, here's that rectangle, plus that little tiny triangle right there. All right, so the trapezoid is those two shapes. Let's first calculate that rectangle, okay? It's a rectangle here because we have all these sides are 90 degrees. Uh, if this side, if CE is X and this right here is X, if this side up here is Y, then this side down here has to be Y. So the area of this little rectangle here would be base times height, which would be Y times X, right? That's the base, that's the height. Uh, so the area of that rectangle is Y times X plus you have the, that area right there of that little triangle. So the area of this trapezoid down there on the bottom would be the area of the rectangle plus the triangle. The area of the rectangle is yx plus the area of that little triangle. So we don't know what that is, we'll call that area z. But this is very important because we already calculated that the area of the triangle abc is y times x, and then the area of the trapezoid would be y times x plus z, z being whatever the heck that area of that little tiny triangle is. z has to be some sort of positive number, so then therefore, boom, 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 this has to be at at least a little bit bigger than the area of the triangle. Uh, so quantity B, which is the area of the trapezoid, is bigger than quantity A. So in the GRE terms, then the answer is B, because quantity B is bigger. I want you to rock and roll in geometry. What you need to do is watch these other geometry videos and keep practicing. You will get better, I promise.